We got pride. Predictions? You know, I can see it going 50 50. Uh, it's a very conservative state. The stakes are very high. Um, I can see it going either way, but you know, all you can do is hope for the best. constitutionally minded individual and this amendment three went beyond trying to define marriage it it was actually just absolutely mean and nasty saying not only we don't recognize gay marriage we don't recognize anything that looks like it Look at the history of Utah, the history of Mormonism. It's, it's really fascinating. The argument that's being used, it, it's animus is, is, is the absolute epitome of what the argument was. It's saying that it will destroy traditional families, it will destroy traditional marriage. It's the absolute same argument that was used to block the territory of Deseret from becoming a state in the United States. It's the very same argument that was used to block interracial marriage. Well, we still have polygamy 200 years later. Interracial marriage hasn't destroyed traditional marriage. In every country, in every state where marriage equality has become the law, heterosexual marriage rates go up, divorce rates go down. I think states' right is the best argument Attorney Reyes had, Attorney General Reyes had. It's a good argument. In it, it, it's really a good argument. The only problem with this argument is there's something called the 14th Amendment, which is the Equal Protection Clause. There's an equally pesky part of our constitutional republic. That's the Supremacy Clause, which means that federal law trumps state law. The, the ruling striking down the part of DOMA makes Amendment 3 unconstitutional, absolutely. I want to be able to see my 15-year-old gay son get married. He needs the exact same rights that are offered to me and to my husband. He needs to have a safe place to go. He's looking at this saying, you know, what, what do I get to look forward to? What, you know, I'm not going to be able to marry my boyfriend. His boyfriend and him, yes, you know, they're 15, but 
you know, they're already talking, getting married at 18 as soon as they can, as soon as it's, as soon as it's legal and as soon as they can, and I will bless it with everything I have.